How is Asheville aided you in getting away from reality? How is Asheville what? Helped you in your goal of getting away from reality? Like, has it helped? Has it been? <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if I've eaten one more broke in me. <laughs> <laughs> We made one. it for you. We had a guy. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Did you leave it here? Yeah, we yeah. gave it to some guy and he said, or like that worked there, and he said he put it in your dressing room. Was it the spiky hair dude? Yeah. yeah. I don't know. What was in the gift basket? <laughs> 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 yeah. Questionable item. Yeah. There, you know, uh, there was a zeit some zeitgeist art we made, um, an excerpt from our novel. There's some helium balloons. <laughs> helium balloons about God. <laughs> Oh my gosh, and a thing about how Stephen King killed John Lennon. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta go back and get it. You have to get it. We worked so hard. Julian, are you planning on making more albums this Oh yeah. Yay! Cool. I was at the opening of the film The only thing I'll say is, I mean, it's very possible that the album's done as an idea. I mean, um, how'd you come up with the time? <laughs> Um, Mr. Billy, the songs that you've written here so far, are you guys, have, do you have any plans to record them? That's a beautiful song. That goes to his question. I mean, I think we're entering into a, a totally different paradigm of why you would record. Right now, you would make the case that if you're going to record music, it's much better on a DVD. Yeah. Because that's the only thing that people are still willing to buy. Sure. I mean, people are willing to spend $30 on a DVD, 25 bucks, or whatever, but they're not willing to spend 12 on a CD. Well, some of us are.